if uh, you know, I hope to be able to hear you soon. Hey, um, so what I'm going to talk about today, um, by the way, my name's Steve. I know I've met one or two of you before, but I um, can't remember. Um, so what we're going to talk about today is the Google Classroom Share, uh, Share to Classroom extension. Um, and so what I'm going to do is I'm, uh, first of all, I've got some notes here. I've put a link to the notes into the chat window um, and so if you click on the chat window um, you will see um, see a hyperlink there and it's got a link a Google Docs link to these notes here um, and I will when I put this on YouTube I'll make sure that that link is in the, um, in the description cool what I'm going to do is I'm going to start from scratch here and, and sort of demonstrate things from the very very beginning so I'm just going to remove a couple of windows. Um, okay, so, um, so as you can see in my notes here, um, teachers and students must be signed into Chrome. Now if you've got a Mac, you know you're signed into Chrome because of this little thing up here. This thing says Steve at TTS. Um, I'm going to open, I have a whole lot of accounts, so I'm going to open um, my student account, my student's name is Lucas, this is what Lucas' account looks like. Um, you can see it says Lucas up there. Um, it more or less looks the same on a PC, like it's very close to that. But the important thing is, that's how you know you're signing into Chrome, not that there. That's just signing into Google, this is signing into Chrome. Signing into Chrome turns on a whole lot of great functionality and one of those things um, is things related to Google Classroom Share Extension. My other account I'm going to open up this is my teacher account for Lucas, and uh, and let me see I've got a few other people joining us, but I don't have audio for them either. Welcome everyone. I am recording this morning's session. So um, so here I am with my my teacher account, and I'm going to go to classroom.google.com. And uh, I am in room 12. This is room 12. And um, I've done a little bit of work with this class yesterday. Um, and in my students, I've only got one student in here. Um, and it's Lucas. Uh, so I'm just demonstrating here that I've got a class set up and Lucas is in the class. Mm -hmm. um, now, as, oh, I can hear somebody. Who's that? Aaron. Uh, I was welcome. Thinking, yes, good. <laughs> Good, you're the only person I can hear. <laughs> Makes me feel good because I'm, I'm not by myself anymore. I know there's other people with me, but I can't hear them. Cool. <laughs> okay, so as a student, this is the student Lucas. I'm going to go to Lucas's account. This is what Lucas looks like. He's got room 12. He's got that handsome, handsome young man as his teacher. <laughs> and you, basically, this is just to demonstrate that they're all in the same class. Now what Lucas is going to do, Lucas is going to get, uh, not distracted, but he's going to go and do some work and uh, and he's just going to open up a Google Doc and, I don't know, start typing. There we are, he's got an essay, it's, it's all very, um, gosh, it's very cerebral. Well done Lucas, <laughs> he's a clever kid. Okay, and the teacher over here, um, he's also going to go do some work and he's actually just going to go on the internet and find some fantastic PD. <laughs> um, okay, and so he's just gone to a website and let's say he is interested in some PD in Taupo. Okay, um, actually he doesn't want to share that with the kids. He's actually going to see what's happening in the news and let's try and find something not so grisly. <laughs> there we go. Severe. Good. Okay. Well, now what? This is the key thing. What uh, Steve, the teacher, wants to do is to interrupt Lucas, to stop what Lucas is doing, and put this thing in front of him. So this might be for mm -hmm. it might be for the news. It might be for a game that we're all going to play now, or it might be for a Kahoot or something like that. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to press this button here, share to classroom. I click on this. Mm -hmm. And it's going to room 12. Mm -hmm. And 
I'm going to push it to students. Yes, push it to students and push. Now, in the background there, you can see that it has just opened up for Lucas. Mm. Okay, so there's no... Lucas doesn't do anything. He, he really can't kind of ignore it. It just happens. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'll do that again. Um, now, those people who I can't hear, I can I can see Marie. Marie, can you hear Hi. me? Hi. Yes. Hi, Marie. How are you? Good, thanks. <laughs> Good. Okay. So I can see there's like about six people on online. I am recording today. Um, so I'm going to do that again, um, and I'll do it from the beginning. Um, just while I set that up, was there any sort of questions about that at all? Do they have to have logged in sort of that morning already or no. sort of immediately? Or? All they need to do is to be logged into Google Chrome. Right, yeah. Um, so, so by definition, if you're using a Google Chromebook, or, you know, any kind of Chromebook, you're logged into yeah. Chrome. Unless yeah. you're in the bad habit of letting students use it as guests, um, I hope you're not doing that kind of thing. Um, I think so. so <laughs> no. So most most schools turn off guest um, yeah. guest access on Chromebooks, but if it's a Chromebook, it's the easiest of all the options. If they're mm -hmm. using a PC, then they log into uh, into Google Chrome, and it sort of looks like this. And if it, I'm obviously using a Mac, and it looks exactly like this. It'll say yeah. Lucas at the top. Um, cool. Right. So I've got Lucas there. I've got Steve, the teacher here. This time I am going to go to the PD because I want Lucas to do some PD. God knows what for. Okay, and there's PD in Taupo. And I'm just going to go share to classroom. Push. Here we go. Now, you saw a couple of those other options there. Yep. So, first of all, I can share it to any one of my classrooms, because I, I might, in fact, I probably will have several. Um, yep. I've selected room 12. Now, I can push it. I can make it an assignment. I can ask a question back. It, I can make an announcement. So, there's a bunch of great things I can do with that. Um, mm -hmm. And if you see down here, it says received from students. I haven't received anything yet. My students hate me. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to uh, Kiwi Kids News. And Lucas is going to go, oh, there's a robot landed on Mars. That's exciting. Nice. Great. And push the teacher. Now, this is where it gets really, really interesting from Google's perspective because they haven't made it automatically pop up for the teacher because that would be just flipping annoying, wouldn't it? Yep. Okay, when the teacher clicks on this, receive from students, there it is. Lucas has sent me that one. Cool. So there's like a little barrier so that it doesn't automatically pop up because um, yep. that would be a little bit dangerous. Okay. Um, now... Going back to my notes, does anybody does anybody find the notes? I can't see anybody who has actually found the notes. No. Did you find I... the chat window? Uh... Yeah, I can find the chat window, but I can't actually see a link in the window. Okay, I will make um, I will do it again. Has it popped up? Yes, it has. Great. Yep. I'm um, just seeing if it'll open. Great. I can see who's this. This is anonymous uh, well, I, rabbit. I'm in. So it's probably me. <laughs> okay. Cool. Yeah, anonymous I'm rabbit, and it's this yeah, and it's anonymous badger. I'm going to say that. Uh, um, Aaron is the badger and Marie is the rabbit. Oh, thanks so much. Okay. Oh, and there's another one, and that must be Fran. Um, so, um, hey, look, uh, I'm going to wrap it up. Um, if there are no further questions. Cool.
No, that was awesome. Yeah, that's really cool. I'll put this on YouTube and you can share it and stuff like that and um, I will look forward to seeing you next Thursday. Cool. Thank you. Cool. Okay, have a fantastic Thursday. Thursday. Yeah, See you guys. Too. Bye. Bye. But short and sweet. Yeah, okay, day. Yeah. okay, you can go back and have a look at it in your own time. Um, I'll ask him how uh, it says it was recorded. So. Um,